If you're like me in Madden NFL 20, you like to roll out with the quarterback, but one of your issues with rolling out with the quarterback or scrambling is you take a lot of fumbles. As you can see here, a lot of times this year, if the quarterback scrambles, there's a lot of fumbles. Well, in today's video, what we're going to do is we're going to simply teach you how do you slide with your quarterback in a way that's going to be effective for you as a runner and you're not going to fumble. As you can see there, there's the fumble. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to my channel. My channel focuses on ways that tip, tips and tricks and strategies and schemes that I can help you get better in Madden NFL 20 and also Madden NFL 21. And so today we're kind of talking a little bit about a very basic level tip, but something that I think is very valuable, at least for me anyways, because I didn't know how to do this for the longest time. How do you slide with your quarterback? Well, the way that you slide with your quarterback, so you'd be scrambling out of the pocket, and you see if you're scrambling out of the pocket, a lot of times you'll fumble with the quarterback. Even if you're on conservative, if you scramble with the quarterback, you'll fumble. Real quick before we give this tip out, what I want to encourage you to do is if this tip helps you at all and you want to get more connected to some of the stuff that I'm doing and also want to get a free guide once we get to 100, once I teach how to do that, what I want to encourage you to do is join our Discord server. A link is in the description of this video. This is going to help you stop fumbling in Madden NFL 20 and ultimately in really every Madden NFL because I don't think this changes much year to year. But anyways, here's how to slide with your quarterback. When you're scrambling out, you want to hold right trigger, left trigger, and square. Right trigger, left trigger, and square on Xbox and on PlayStation. So, for example, if I'm scrambling out and I hold and I just hold left or whoops, if I just hold left trigger, then you're gonna see what happens is actually I'm sorry. If I just hold square, because a lot of people do that, they'll just come in and they'll be holding square. You'll see he's gonna dive now. That will, there's times where that's really important, like on the goal line or whatever, and you want to try to get in the end zone. But you'll find if I dive into people, you see right there, that's what happens. You get a lot of fumbles when that type of thing happens. And so, what I like to recommend people to do, again, is to always slide with your quarterback no matter what. So, when I'm going to take a hit, and, I, and I'm guilty of it, sometimes you get greedy, you try to get a little bit of extra yards, but you really want to master that, that left trigger, right trigger to scramble out, and then left trigger, right trigger to dive. The reason I like left trigger scramble this year, I think you get a little bit of a better animation, unless he's a skate artist quarterback, and even I think if he is, you want to use that left trigger. But that left trigger behind the line of scrimmage, what that's going to do, if you if you hold left trigger, um, if I, whoops, I'm sorry, if I double click left trigger, I'm sorry, he's going to go into what's like a uh, basically a runner behind the line of scrimmage. So right there. If I click left trigger and then I go. And this is a new little scramble technique that a lot of people are using to be able to help some of those guys. But you see he becomes a runner and then he and then he goes. Now again, want to make sure that you slide behind the quarterback. You'll see here if I'm scrambling behind the line of scrimmage and I hold right trigger, left trigger, he's still going to throw as you see right there. So if you want your quarterback to slide behind the line of scrimmage, maybe you're scrambling out and you're just trying to take time off the clock, you want to click left stick and then hold left trigger, have, click left stick, and then hold left trigger, right trigger, and square, or X if you're playing on Xbox. So left trigger, and then there. That's a simple slide. So that's a quick tip of how to slide with your quarterback in Madden NFL 20. I don't see this changing in Madden NFL 21, but again, just wanted to give you a quick tip and a little bonus about that left trigger scramble technique in the back of the pocket. So thank you for watching this video. If this video helped you, and if you'd like to be a little bit more uh, connected with my community, what I would want to encourage you to do is to join our Discord server. It's free to join, and we're going to give you a free offensive and defensive guide once we hit 100 members in that, in that server. The link Link to join is in the comments and in the description of this video. If you need a new link, just let me know because they expire every while. So just comment and let me know if you need a link. I'd love to, love to send that to you. And then also, if you're looking for more tips and tricks for Madden 20, we have a lot of them on our YouTube channel, and we're going to be bringing a lot of different 